Peace and prosperity be unto all who's listening and watching. It's your girl Shay Muller right now. I'm back with another video. And today's video is about your pain is your power. And how sometimes you have to turn in your pain into the thing that pushes you to be your best self. All the pain, all the suffering you endured, all the things you've been through, all the hurt you may experience, they're all here to teach us a lesson, to help us become something better, to help us reflect on how we can do better. The pain is so much power because power is growth. And there's so much equal opportunity and growth. When pain allows you to mature, to grow up, to start seeing things in a different light, to start doing things in a better way. Pain allows you to see things that you never thought you could when you weren't in pain. When you're at complete peace and you're not experiencing anything, you kind of like existing but not experiencing, then you're not learning, then you're not growing, then you're not evolving. And I think the purpose a pain is growth because we all have to endure something we all have to suffer through something we all have to one day have a testimony right we all had to one day evolve beyond this self today to become the best self tomorrow or however long we live ultimately this self who we are today or who we were yesterday is not the best self yet we're not even our full potential yet, let alone half of it. We have so much to work on, so much improvement to do, and so much more experiences that we have to have. And you have to endure a lot of suffering in life. Some long suffering, some short sufferings, but all sufferings and pain help you mature, help you develop character, help you get through things, help you see things in a better light, help you become the best version of yourself even if you don't see it, even if you're dwelling in the pain and like, why is this happening to me? You know, sometimes we get caught up on what's happening to you, but there's some people in this world that goes through so much more than us. And sometimes we have to look at the bigger picture. Why am I going through this lesson? What is this lesson here to teach me? What is this pain teaching me? What things have I done? What mistakes have I ma made? What decisions is it pushing me towards? <laughs> Sometimes pain triggers us to go into a different direction. It's kind of like, it's kind of like a river. It flows in a direction once it's going. Same with pain. Pain pushes you to either be better or dwell at the same. Some people stay and remain and some people allow pain to become their purpose and allow it to push them it becomes their power and they become better they learn they don't dwell they reflect they grow what is the pain in your life and the sufferings that you may experience what has it teach you as a person about yourself about the way you think about your experiences about what you're here to do in this life, about what you want to do in this life, uh, about what kind of person you are. What is the storms in life teaching you about you? That's what the pain is for. That's what the suffering is for. It's supposed to teach you about you and about life and about people and how to be a better person. Suffering a life brings forth pain, but also brings forth power when you use that power to for a greater use and a greater purpose when you use that divine will to do great things. Turn your pain into power and let peace be among you. I'm out.